Be thou exalted, O God, above the heavens. Let thy glory be above all the earth. Psalm 57, verse 5. Welcome to the miracle and healing ministry of Jesus Christ. Listen now as his servant, Apostle Tanya, teaches on the Word of God. We invite you to visit us online at www.apostletanya.org. The teaching you are about to listen to was taught through me by the dearest Holy Spirit before my miraculous voice change from thy Lord. In the fall of 2020, the Holy Father was most generous to give me a surprise miracle of a new speaking voice. And for a season afterwards, this miraculous speaking voice change continued to be stronger and develop into a sound wherewith I gather was the eternal Lord's original intent. I want to thank you who are new to the ministry for your prayers and for your support. And welcome to all the new family members of the ministry. I want to encourage you to contact us if you are in need of prayer or are led by the Holy Spirit to serve with the ministry. Friends, together, let us exalt our blessed Master and declare His greatness in the earth. Amen. Listening to some music before I called in to record this call. One of my favorite soaking music uh, is, um, I'm going to ensure that you have the link to it. Uh, Her name is Laura. And whenever I feel that it's getting down to that hour when my body's just saying, It's time to rest, and I know it's not yet time to rest. I soak. I soak, and I soaked a few minutes before I got on this call. And the Lord Jesus, he is ever faithful. Do you hear me? He is ever faithful to meet me there in the tiredness of the body. Hallelujah. And we bless him. Whatever it is, give it to him. Whatever it is, give it to him. (sighs) Hallelujah. We give you all the glory, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. (laughs) We bless you, Jesus. Glory to God. Thank you. And now, by his grace, I am going to answer two of the questions to your answer, two of your questions. Hallelujah. (laughs) Glory to God. Hallelujah. Don't you love it when the Holy Spirit begins to tickle you? (laughs) Hallelujah. The joy of the Lord is your strength, I tell you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. The first question is what and this is of course to me what would you say is the scripture that has spoken to you the most during a season of warfare and my answer is i would say that it is the first book of corinthians chapter 4 verse verses 9 through 12. it has been one of the most profound scriptures that thy Lord has used to speak to my heart most recently. I would say perhaps recently he began to speak to me with this scripture, with these scriptures 
And about two years ago, he spoke to me in that same, those same verses. And it, it just happened to really take me into a different place. Every time we read, we should get fresh revelation. And this time, I really received what he wanted me to have for this moment. And so I encourage you to read it. It was the first, it's the first book of Corinthians, chapter 4, verses 9 through 12. Amen. Hallelujah. And I thank you again for your patience with my voice. I don't normally sound like this. Very, um, thank God that it didn't completely stop talking <laughs> right before the call. <laughs> oh, hallelujah. <laughs> All right. And the second question is, Apostle, how is your life with the Holy Spirit in the way that he uses you? Ooh. <laughs> Glory to God. I thank you, Lord, for allowing me to answer this. It's not easy speaking about it. It's very easy for me. It's most easy when I write about it. It is a glorious relationship that is, of course, like all of ours, a sacred. And some things are not ready to be revealed. And that is how it has been for me with this walk that he has me on. 